Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And um, somebody was asking in a question about copying files in Windows. And he uses, of course, the File Explorer and copies folders and files. But he's come across so many problems uh, when it goes through um, big files and particularly folders that contain thousands and thousands of files. Uh, he finds that it kind of slows down and it takes a long time and also that sometimes it can create some error messages or have problems. So the question was, is there something um, that could replace it? So there is, of course, third-party file copy software out there that can be used. Some people might actually uh, comment if you have one that you like, uh, share the name, and um, we'll uh, check them out. Uh, but remember that in Windows, there's not just the copy, paste, and copy folder, or, you know, whatever you want to do uh, with File Explorer. There's a command line called RoboCopy. So if you go and um, ask for the command prompt and run it in administrator mode, you have a command RoboCopy. And RoboCopy has, of course, different flags that you have to uh, enter. So you'd say RoboCopy, um, you know, space, uh, the drive, and in the source directory, for example, followed by the destination directory and drive, depending on where you want to copy stuff. Yes, it is more complicated than using a, um, you know, graphical user interface copy um, command, but it works better than the File Explorer copy and often is much faster also. I'll share the uh, link to the um, RoboCopy page within um, Microsoft documentation where you'll see how it works and they'll give you all the flags of what options you have available. It's a very complete uh, way of uh, copying files and there's so many little specifications that you can give, you know, specified types of files and types of data that you want to copy, mirror files, all sorts of things like that. And it also has one great option that it does log what you're doing. So if in File Explorer you get an error message, you got to figure out where it stopped copying. Uh, RoboCopy in its own logs knows where it was, so you can actually continue a copying of a um, folder, for example, or a drive where it was when it actually stopped. So this is, of course, very useful because you don't have to search. It knows where it was and it'll continue where it stopped when something happened. So uh, this, I'll share this documentation um, and that is one option. Of course, if you guys have your favorite um, file explorer um, replacement that uh, you use, let us know in the uh, comments below. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.